Let's start with this 1922 No D. Lincoln sent with lamination error. Graded as VF 25 Brown by NGC. VF standing for very fine according to coin grading scale. As a representative of this highly sought after variety, obverse of this penny is weakly struck, plus slightly worn due to circulation. Other than that, it displays lamination gouge near the head of the Lincoln. In numismatics, obverse lamination refers to a type of mint error where a layer of the coin's metal separates or peels away from the coin's surface on the front side the obverse. This results in a thin layer or layers of metal lifting or peeling off the coin, creating a noticeable defect. Collectors often find mint errors like lamination interesting and valuable due to their rarity and the unique appearance they give to the affected coins. This one was sold for $780 on November 29, 2023. Here is 1980 Lincoln cent with obverse indent. Graded as MS63 red and brown by NGC. A 1980 Lincoln sent with an obverse indent, is a coin that has been affected by an unusual minting mishap. In this case, an obverse indent suggests that there was a foreign object present on the planchet, blank coin disc, when it was struck by the coin dies at the mint. The indent can vary in size and depth depending on the nature of the obstruction and the force of the strike. Such errors are often considered interesting to collectors due to their unique nature and the story they tell about the minting process. The value of a 1980 Lincoln sent with an obverse indent depends on several factors including the severity of the indent, overall condition of the coin, and demand among collectors for such errors. This one ended up selling for $71. This is 2020 Shield sent with reverse split die error. Graded in mint state 63 red by NGC. A split die error happens when a coin die, the metal stamp used to strike coins, becomes cracked or broken. This damage to the die can result in portions of the design being duplicated or shifted slightly, creating a doubled effect on the struck coins. Coins with reverse split die errors, especially in more recent years like the 2020 Shield Scent, can be of interest to collectors and enthusiasts of error coins. The severity and visibility of the split die error, as well as the overall condition of the coin, will influence its desirability and potential value. This one ended up selling for $288. Here is 1919's Lincoln sent struck 10% off center towards 1 o'clock. When a coin is struck off center, it means that the coin blank, planchet, was not properly aligned with the coin dies during the striking process at the mint. In this case around 10% of the design is missing, and the rest of the design is shifted towards the 1 o'clock position on the clock face if you were to imagine the scent as a clock. It was sold for $115. Thank you for joining us on this exploration of error Lincoln sense. Remember, Even the smallest detail can make a coin valuable to collectors. Don't underestimate the potential of your pocket change. Be sure to subscribe for more numismatic insights and coin collecting tips. God's willing, see you in the next episode.